1980, as in 1980, President Carter boycotted our Olympic team to go to the uh, Olympics in Moscow. To the uh, Olympic trials, they get to pin everybody, except, except in the finals. It was best two out of three. The first time I only won 16-3. But the second time I pinned a guy with this move. The guys that were first, second, third, and fourth in the Olympics at my weight class, I pinned with this. Um, the guy who was fourth in the Olympics at my weight class, I was beaten like 15 to two when I pinned him in about a minute. The guy who was third in the Olympics, I was beaten 27 to two when I pinned him with this uh, at the beginning of the second period. The guy who was second in the Olympics at my weight, I was beating 24 to three when I pinned with this at the beginning of the second period. And the Olympic champ who was beating me eight nothing at the end of the first period, in about a minute, I was beating him 14 to eight when I stuck him with this half. If the guy does not want to get turned, you know what, that's too bad. If I can get underneath an armpit and I can get the head turned. Now 99 out of 100 times this guy's gonna turn his head away for me anyway. He's probably gonna put his right hip down, put his left leg out there, put his left arm out there. All right, he does not want me to turn him. That is fine. I want his wrist. Though not, none of those guys would give me their wrist. I thought that was pretty rude. I wanted the wrist. <laughs> so what I would do is I would take my hand and I would put it on the mat. I am going to crawl my hand forward. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pinch his armpits. I'm gonna put my right cheek on my right hand. I'm going to whisper in his ear. <laughs> then what I'm going to do is I'm going to pinch my elbows to his armpits. I am going to lift his armpits up over his head. As I lift the armpits up over his head, I'm going to place this all the way on his forehead. So I am going to take them straight over the top, right to here, and then pin them. Can you go anywhere? I think that means no. All right. Okay. All right. So, I, I know, I, I really believe that those guys that were first, second, third, and fourth in the Olympics in my weight didn't really want to get pinned. Um, but you can change their minds. You know, sometimes there are some things that can, you, you just be a nice guy and say, hey man, please change your mind. It'll make my life a lot easier. I'll tell you. And then they do. So, I've got the hat. He turns that right hip down. He goes, I'm not getting turned. I'm like, give me that. 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 Give Right cheek on the right hand. I'm gonna pinch my elbows and lift his armpits up over his head. As I go, I catch that armpit, that forearm. Right there, elbow to elbow. Can you go anywhere? See <laughs> Again. He does not want to get turned. So sunny. I've got my hat on. <coughs> Thank you. <laughs> Give me that wrist. Be. See, now he's being a jerk. He's not giving me the wrist. He was just like those other guys. Right cheek on the right hand. <laughs> right cheek on the right hand. Now, at, the only reason I'm pinching uh, my elbows is because it will help me lift his armpits and place all the way on his forehead. And that way, when I take him straight over the top right in here, now I can catch this far elbow right to there. He can't go anywhere. Look at my elbows holding his hip up in the air. There's lots and lots and lots of pressure. Any questions if the guy tries to flatten out? I take him in what direction? 12 o'clock? It's called the Midnight Express. What's midnight mean? 12 o'clock. What's express mean? Fast. Fast. If we take it at 12 o'clock, fast. <coughs> oh, can I see it later? Facing that way? All right. He uh... asked. <laughs> He's sitting there going like this. <laughs> but now, right? All right. Oh, I've got the hat right here. Oh, I want the arm. He won't give it to me. Arm, please. Right to here. Right now, my left thigh is up as brown eyed Tojo. What I'm going to do once I pinch and start to drive, my left thigh is going to come out of his brown eyed Tojo because I don't want it stuck there. All right? That thing's like a suction cup. So I want to drive forward and come out to the side and get my knee underneath as I catch this arm. <laughs> All right, any questions on Midnight Express if the guy tries to flatten out? Kids, break up and pin your partner. <laughs> <laughs>